Alright guys, so this is Friday, the move out day of my dorm room. This is going to be the start of my first vlog on my travels. Uh, what this video will entail will be me taking down my dorm room, and then on to the way to the airport, the flights, and then once I actually arrive in Helsinki. So, this is going to be the start to that. Um, but yeah, it should be a very long ride. Now this, is, this video is going to be like, this is Friday, I'm flying out on Sunday, so this will be a couple days before some of the footage you'll see in this, but it's going to be a big trip, it's going to be a long trip. And I don't know, I think it'd be pretty cool to see me pack up the rest of my room. My roommate already moved out, so I'm left with putting some of the stuff back, and I gotta fill my car with all this crap, take down my setup, and yes, we'll get into that. Well, that pretty much concludes me packing up all my stuff. Now all I need to do is vacuum the floor. Um, I cleaned off pretty much everything, throw out the garbage, Unplug everything. Yeah, just vacuum the floor over here, and then move all this to my car. And then I'm good to go, guys. So we'll be probably the next part you'll see is when I'm actually leaving from my house or something, and I'm in the airport. So yeah, we'll fast forward to there. Like, oh, I'll be there right now. Bye, Zoe. Good morning, you all. Yeah. You all in there? No. Why you want me to put it all in there? The flags? So, we made it through security. We're in the business center right now, you can see. We're in the Green Bay Airport. It's actually really small. Really nice. You can see, it's pretty short. Pretty small. My terminal is over to the left. We do have free Wi-Fi. But I don't know. Looks pretty sweet. <laughs> Haven't flown out in like, I don't know, six years. Couldn't really sleep last night. Pretty excited. And I also have that bad cough. See the little bird there. Um, security <coughs> wasn't too bad. Really easy. Again. Big shout out to my parents, mainly my dad for helping me through this, uh, getting like ready and stuff. See those little planes, we're taking those all the way to Finland. Just kidding. <laughs> but yeah, so I gotta go to Chicago, and then I gotta go to, from Chicago to Stockholm, and then Stockholm to Helsinki, so got a long, long flight ahead of me, long flights, and everything like that, so it's, it's pretty interesting, I'm excited. Landed in Chicago, biggest airport probably on my trip. Had a little troubles getting here, but we're on the airport transit. The flight wasn't too bad to from Green Bay to Chicago. I just pretty much slept the whole 45 minutes. Um, but now we're landed, and I'll talk to you guys when we actually do find my correct terminal. Probably have to go through customs though, so interesting stuff. In the transit system. to see all these cars. It's like I'm on a plane all over again. Made it through customs. Freaking sweating my balls off. Let's look at some big freaking planes. <clears throat> my voice is pretty much completely gone, but I can't even hear because of how loud it was, but man, that customs line was a long, long wait. We're walking around now. Um, don't even know what time it is. I didn't really look. I know I got like a couple hours till my next flight, so I'll be chilling in the Chicago airport for a while. I'm gonna get some food. So after a long six-hour delay in Chicago airport, 
You can see my flight is finally starting to get going here. It's been really long, I've been sleeping, I'm trying to eat. But yeah, I'm finally glad to be leaving Chicago. I'm away to Stockholm. I don't know, I just, I don't feel the best right now, but that's probably just because from sleeping and stuff like that. But I'll show you guys the flight and hopefully we land safe in Stockholm. As you can see, made it in the Stockholm airport. Got the nice little shops around. Looks pretty, pretty awesome. But yeah, that, that flight was really, really long, but it was actually probably one of the better ones, even though it was like the eight hour flight, it was actually really, really comfortable on it and everything like that. And I kind of slept most of it, watched some movies. But now we're on the, off our way to, or on our way to Helsinki. I'm kind of, I'm actually really tired. And I really want to take a shower, but Gotta get my rebooked tickets because I don't know if I explained, but my flight got delayed by like, I don't know, I'd say like five hours in Chicago. Or I think it was a little bit longer than that. Cause it was, you know, it was five hours. So that was kind of boring, but we're here now and I'm almost to Helsinki. On my other flights there was clouds. This is uh, flying from Stockholm to uh, Helsinki. So maybe we're in Finland right now because we just flew over the water, as you can see over there. This is the land. This is a pretty short flight. Um, probably been on here like 20 minutes, so I assume we're over Finland right now. So is soccer like the main sport here? Uh, no. Actually. No? No, because we are rather northern, northern European country. Of course, like like speed in Norway as well, but but uh, ice hockey. Ice hockey, all right. Yeah, ice hockey, of course, because the season is long, much much longer. Of course, ice hockey season. It's the indoor ice hockey. Yeah. Ice it doesn't matter nowadays. Mm -hmm. the season, but soccer season is much shorter because mm -hmm. it's only those uh, those uh, summer season months. Uh, you can practice. Of course, there are indoor soccer. Uh, Places as well, but not so much. That's why the ice hockey is the main sport. Oh. But of course, soccer is it's really it's in Europe and also in Finland. It's it, uh, it is the one of the main sports, but not so not the main major anyway. Because ice hockey is the one anyway in Finland. And now at the moment, actually, there is a going on in. in Chester Republic in Prague, there is going this uh, Ice Hockey World Championship. World Championship? Yeah, yeah. tournament. And, uh, uh, that's a good one, which at least Finns are really eager to watch <laughs> games. That's how it goes. Because we have won only twice uh, the uh, World Championship in, in, mm -hmm. in Ice Hockey in games in the monitor, because of course they are so <laughs> those games also in the monitors. There was oh. some customer who was a little bit complaining that the <coughs> of soccer, uh, uh, this UEFA championship uh, tournament which was going on also in Europe at the moment. And that uh, there was not many places uh, in Helsinki which were showing this uh, tournament, but only ice hockey, ice hockey, ice hockey. Was, yeah. yeah. But I say that they have uh, sports bars which are showing whatever you just say that because they have all the channels, whatever, in, 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 in snooker or golf or let's say that, okay, I would like to see that they, they will pick up you there. Mm -hmm. I don't know, I wish it was uh, ice hockey was more popular in the United States because it's like, more towards Canada, it's yeah, more Canada, popular. Yeah, Canada is really, yeah, that's right, it's not in the USA so much. Mm -hmm. Of course, American football is totally different, baseball as well, and yeah. 
Did yeah. you know, by the way, that in, in Finland we are playing also baseball, but, but not the same, same kind Is of. it cricket? It's not cricket. So we just made it into the hotel. The long travel is over. I didn't even look at anything in this room. Your boy is jet lagged, has a headache, is hungry. Freaking delays in Chicago, man. <laughs> well, we actually didn't make it here, surprisingly. I don't know how that really happened. You can probably see the view. I can't really. Um, I guess I have wine if I want. Uh, nah, no thanks. Let's go to the bathroom and then, like. It's light, sir. Should get some of those in my house. <laughs> But, the bathrooms, a little interesting. If you take a very long shower, it looks like you like flood this entire floor, but yeah, not bad. Not bad, we made it here. I'm, I need to take a shower, so. Yeah, I'm trying to take you in. I don't know what that's for. I have no idea what that's for. So after I took my shower and got like myself reacquainted in my room, because I was feeling pretty bad, like I was sick, stomach hurt, headache, and then, but I took a shower and felt a little bit better. Went down, met up with everyone in the lobby. We were waiting on Reversal and a couple other of the Clash YouTubers. So we were just like shooting this shit, talking about, I don't know, just random things. And in the video, and this is Tim to my right here. Tim is the community manager for Boom Beach. He's like, he's, I don't know, he's a really cool dude. We've been talking a lot. And then this is at... Uh, after everyone got there, like reversal and stuff, we went to this really nice, nice uh, finished restaurant, and like I don't know, they had like reindeer and stuff. So I just got the safe, safe route, got the sirloin steak, but everyone's meal there. Uh, I was at the table with Bootramp across me, and then I think like Chief Pat and Nick were to my right. And then this is later on in the night, um, back at the hotel, just playing. We were playing, we were actually playing Bangalore with some of the devs too, and then their new game Smashland, playing that. Uh, but I don't know, like, I'm recording or edited my day one vlog, even though I've been here for two days now, and then I'm editing my day two vlog after this, so I hope you guys are enjoying this, make sure to like if you guys want to see more vlogs of the Supercell trip, uh, trip. day two is pretty interesting, I will say, did a lot of stuff today, um, but I'm like a day behind on the uploads because of the delay set me back, and then first day was really busy, second day was really busy, but hope you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to like if you did, and don't forget to subscribe for more Boom Beach videos if you're not ready, hope you guys have a wonderful day or night, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.